Welcome back to Super Sentai Review, episode number 110. Last episode was 109, I had to correct that there. This episode, two episodes again, because that's what I got here. These are essentially a two-parter, which is also kind of focused on Blue 3, where this reveals a secret about Dr. Man. He's got a son! Well... Before we get to that, I think it starts off with this weird tube that comes out of the ground and starts to up gas. Yes, seriously. And apparently this is a plan by Mason. Yeah. And of course the Biomine show up to fight him and then like, oh, and then someone tells Mason to knock it off like, and you wonder who the heck it is. It's a guy who claims to be Prince. He's the son of Dr. Man. Who knew? That Dr. Man, the main villain of this entire run, is a family man. Oh yeah, definitely. He's a family man, alright. Yep. Who would have thunk it, right? Yeah, who would have thunk it? So, with this one, they kind of basically, like... And of course, Mason Mason gets damaged in this uh, attack that, of course, Prince up destroying the, this this gas factory anyways, his gas plant. He gets damaged, and so does his subordinate. And I was wondering what the heck happened to you. There's like some some guy claiming to be Doctor Man, and then there he is, Prince. That's seriously the guy's name, Prince. And he's like, oh yeah, this is my right hand man. And he'll basically obey his orders that they're mine. And something's been all about Dr. Man. Where he's like coughing in this two-parter. And at one point, basically, oh yeah. And the mecha of this one is, is a grotesque mecha. Yeah. Where every time you slice it, uh, they slice it with the bio-robots. And it'll spit out his, his medical intest his, his mecha intestines. No, seriously. That's literally what happens here. So they come with the ingenious idea of removing them, and then when they remove them, like so they won't grow back. <clears throat> Prince gets throws a hissy fit and just jumps out of his own mega, just out of his own mecha, and basically just uses a bunch of mecha clones just happen to be nearby, and start killing random people just to get those intestines back. And eventually they do, and then they kind of fight again. And of course, basically, Blue Three questions him about about having him having a mom. That's a hint of something basically probably will explore to later on. Yep. And of course, basically, it turns out later on when we try to look for his supposed to look for his mom, it turns out this is not actually Doctor Man's son. From what I read, he does actually have a son, but this guy is not him. Nope, it's a Mecha Human. Yeah. So later on, he sent once again to fight the Bio Man, which he eventually does lose. That's a pretty lengthy battle in part two of this two parter. And we show a Doctor Man, basically, we do confirm he is human, and he's solely turned himself into a robot. He said, and he says in the, the two parter, like, I need to become human to come eternal life. Also, he chats his own subordinate, like, he basically blasts up Monster's arm, and he injures several others just because they dare question him about this. Yeah, very interesting two-parter. Definitely feels like... It doesn't feel like a random episode. But it doesn't feel like filler. Excuse me. This one does feel like basically advancing the plot a bit. But we won't get back to this for another five episodes. Yep. Because next four have nothing to do with this at all. Yeah. Those was guys in video. So, yeah, let me just discuss here. Just two really good episodes. Yeah, better than episode 17, 18. Yep. So yes, that's it for Circle View. Next one's going to be Shaman King. Okay, next video. Bye.